Let's get back to that major storm in southern Ontario. Heavy rains have brought severe flooding to Toronto and the surrounding areas. This was the first wave of a major storm system that hit at the peak of the afternoon rush hour. It caught hundreds of thousands of people off guard. And our Haver Gould was one of those people caught up in it all. Haver. Now, I was on a crowded su subway platform when suddenly everything went dark. As soon as I managed to get above ground again, it was obvious why. Thunder showers were expected. This was not. This began as a sunny day in southern Ontario. Then, around the afternoon rush hour, came a truly massive amount of rain. It quickly created widespread flooding, and hundreds of thousands of people were suddenly without power. The flooding spread out over a huge area. Several major highways were suddenly impassable. Cars abandoned all over the Toronto area, in some cases, in water more than two meters deep. And all of a sudden, this guy comes barreling down in his Ferrari and just crashes straight into the water. That's so bad. <laughs> Passengers on buses captured pictures of the water at their feet. This is water flooding down an elevator shaft into a parking garage. Toronto's subway system was shut down. Busy stations plunged into darkness with passengers trapped on trains. This commuter train, too, was also out of service for obvious reasons. On a day when many people didn't bother to bring umbrellas, the sudden and violent storm caught millions of people by surprise. It's an amazing storm, a truly stunning storm. It might have been as much as 100 millimeters of rain that may have soaked southern Ontario. The lights are coming back on, but it's too early to get a complete picture of the damage. Anne-Marie?